morning, After Dog. I'm Sam. I'm Ethan. And today is Tuesday, Tuesday, March 27th. Please rise for a moment of silence and a pledge to the flag. guys here today a representative from Cairn University will be here at 9 o'clock. What was that? Uh, any students interested in meeting with this representative, please see Mrs. Ditzler in the counseling office. Attention, Ephra High School. Do you love donuts? No. Uh, <laughs> On Wednesday, March 28th at 7 a.m., EHS Bible study will be serving donuts and sharing about Easter. Come join us and eat some fresh Weiser's donuts and give your day an excellent start. Uh. Have you ever wondered what it would be like to be legally blind? Have you ever seen someone with a visual impairment and wondered how they navigate the world? Well, we have an opportunity for you. You. <laughs> On Wednesday, March 28th, the FFA will be hosting specialist Andrea Bonari to teach us how the visually impaired use tools like canes, braille, and sighted guides to do everyday tasks. Participants will also have the opportunity to experience what it's like to have a visual impairment through the use of simulation glasses. The workshop will start after school at 2.50 p.m. in room 316. You do not, not, not have to be an FFA member to participate. All are welcome. Class of 2019, looking for an incredible free leadership opportunity this summer? Check out the Rotary Youth Leaders Award <laughs> conference at Messiah College this summer. June 10th through the 14th. Ryla provides leadership training for outstanding young men and women. The schedule includes various speakers, career seminars, a challenge course, team building activities, and much, much more. For more information about this free student leadership conference, be sure to check out the application in Schoology, or you can pick one up in the counseling office. Don't delay. Because initial paperwork needs to be submitted to the counseling office by April 5th. If you have any questions, please see your counselor ASAP. Attention seniors! The Ephrata National Bank scholarships, including the Hipschman Scholarship, are now open. Log on to Naviance Family Connection to complete your applications. Apply today and get free money for college. Applications and all materials are due by March 31st. Now over to Seth with the news. And that's the way the news goes. Oh, hey, after that. Didn't see you there, but I was just staring at Mr. Bischoff over in the sound booth and just <laughs> gazing into his eyes. Sorry about that. Anyway, in more serious news, a fire in the mall killed 64 people in Russian Siberia yesterday, 41 of them being children. Although the cause of the fire is unknown, President Putin has claimed the source of the fire to be criminal negligence. 300 people gathered outside the local government headquarters to demand the dismissal of authorities and for someone to be held accountable for the oversight in safety measures and regulations. On this day in history, a newly developed fingerprint technology is used to solve a murder case in England for the first time. And because it's England, I think I'll try to read this in the British accent. Although I'm not very good at the British accent, but I'll try my best. Two victims, Thomas and Anne Farrow, kept, who kept the shop in South London, were found beaten, killed, and robbed. Investigators found a fingerprint on their safe that didn't match either of the victims or the small collection of fingerprints that Scotland Yard had on the files. Investigators were eventually led to two brothers, <laughs> Alfred and Albert Scratton, and sure enough, the fingerprint on the cash box matched Alfred's. I'm sorry to anybody that was offended by that terrible British accent. Now over to me and Edwin with the lunch. Hi, Ephrata. Guess where we're at today? Let me know or Edwin know in the hallway. Today for lunch, we have walking tacos, mozzarella stuffed sticks and sauce, Papa John's pizza, ham, roast beef, cheese wrap, a fruit and yogurt parfait with a muffin, buffalo chicken salad, refried beans, Mexican corn, Great tomatoes and dip. Assorted fresh fruit or slushy. And uh, come see Beauty and the Beast.
Sports Resorts tennis lost at Cedar Crest and softball had their game postponed to today. So there's no score for that. And boys lacrosse won big against Wyoming 17-4 and a shout out to freshman Brock Boyer for a good game. Today in sports, girls lacrosse is away at Wyoming, boys tennis is away at Conestoga Valley, volleyball is away at Cacalico, and again, girls softball is against Cacalico. Talk now back to the main play. coach. Shut up! <laughs> This announcement is for any students who would like to learn more about the United States Naval Academy as a post-secondary college option. There will be a bus trip to visit the Academy, which is located in Annapolis, Maryland, on Saturday, March 31st. The purpose of this trip is to give interested students and their parents an opportunity to see the Academy firsthand, learn about the application and appointment process, and meet with local area high school graduates who are presently midshipmen in the Academy. If you have an interest in serving your country as an officer, this is a great way to attend college for free as a degree from the academy is estimated to be worth approximately $400,000 for the four-year program. Check out the information sheet on Schoology if you would like to learn more. Uh, sophomores and juniors, we are looking for responsible 10th and 11th graders with communication skills and leadership potential who have uh, good hand-eye coordination, who are interested in serving as link crew leaders next year. You could have a tremendous impact on our new students, and you will learn many valuable leadership skills in the process. If this sounds interesting to you, fill out an application right away. Applications are available with the Schoology and are due by Thursday, March 29th at 3 p.m. In addition to the online application, be sure to have your favorite teacher complete a teacher recommendation form and return it to the counseling office by before Friday, April 6th. If you aren't sure and would like to know more, <laughs> please see Mrs. Mandel or Mr. Urbowski for more information. Uh, that's it from me and us. Ladies love me. Sorry, that it's... was just for somebody that was watching. Oh, special anyway. somewhat. No, not really, okay. actually. Have a oh, what is it? Have a Bishop Tuesday. Oh, it's best ever Tuesday you can have, guys. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I can picture it very well. That wasn't a joke. That was just stupid. Why is it still going? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, 